Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to go ahead and get this message here. Manifesting uh, your true union and what you need to know here. Make sure you like, subscribe, definitely share the video. Alright, Spirit. What do we need to know? All right, so we have, wow, a new world is born here. So, yeah, somebody's definitely manifesting a new world for themselves when it pertains to their love life here. Somebody could be 45. And, yeah, the unexpected, a change you did not see coming. So, there is a change that's coming in. Maybe you're going to be shocked about your manifestation or how quick it came in for you or however this is going to resonate with you here. Yeah, now you are independent and free here. So maybe you had to take the time out to work on yourself here. And now you feel like you're just, you're ready. <laughs> yeah, we got positive uplifting friends. So you may have, you know, friends that you have that's coming into your life as well. We got endless regrets, obsessive grief, replaying the past, negative nostalgia here. So maybe the unexpected change um, you did not see coming is that you were going to be able to get over past energies here. And yeah, you need some space in a relationship. So you took the time out to do some type of inner work here um, because maybe you kept getting bozos and you wanted a Boaz or something like that. Or maybe you were manifesting a Ruth and you kept getting, I don't know, a 403 here, okay? <laughs> I feel like you inspired trust and um, you got confidence here. So you may have people that know you're single or something like that, or they know you been in bad relationships and I feel like they know you're going to get what you want here. Okay. People may know that you're a very powerful manifester here. So let's see. A new world is born here. What we got, sir? Wow. Love language is gift giving here. So it looks like a new world is being born. If you were the one always giving in the relationships, it seemed like you're going to have some type of reciprocity here. Token of reciprocity holds cherish and memories here. <laughs> somebody may even get somebody a puppy here. All right. So we got these unexpected uh, changes here. You did not see coming. Wow. Somebody may reach out to you or something like that here. And we have friendly support here. So you may have somebody already in mind that you're manifesting. Maybe you were already friends with this person. And maybe you're wanting to take it to the next level. Okay. Um, now that you're independent and free or something like that here. Maybe you had a lot of responsibilities and you were able to balance that out now. Yeah. Somebody's ready for some type of physical connection here. Okay. <laughs> The sacred union of bodies to becoming one here. Wow. Positive, uplifting friends. What we got here? Maybe you've been having your friends help you or something like that. Yeah, there's something about a twin flame union here. Heart, body, mind, and soul here. There's going to be some type of honest communication or something like that here. We got endless regrets, obsessive grief, replaying the past, and negative nostalgia here. Wow, you are worthy here. So it wanted to come in reverse in my hand. So maybe you were struggling with your worth here, realizing what you truly do deserve here. Maybe you realizing that you were settling for less here. And now you're in this energy is that you're not going to settle for less. You're going to start manifesting exactly what you want. You need some space in a relationship here. Yeah, real feelings here. You share true romantic feelings worth exploring here. And then, wow, we got spirit souls path here. So you're definitely on the right path here. Um, to pretty much get what you want is what I'm getting here. Whatever you've been desiring, it's on the way here. Wow. Wow. So what we got here, Spirit? Tell me about this love language of giving here. 
Wow. So we got the page of cups here. Okay. Somebody's going to be creative when it's time to give to you. Um, somebody's going to put in a lot of hard work with the eight of pentacles here. And yeah, they're going to make an investment with the seven of pentacles here. Um, I feel like you don't see this coming with the moon energy here. Okay. It's kind of like a surprise for you or something that's coming in when it comes to, yeah, you're going to be able to move to common waters for sure. And it looks like with the Ace of Pentacles and the star energy, it's like because you're on the right path, because you did the, the inner work here, you're going to be expanding with someone new here. Wow. It's like your ships are coming in. Um, some of you guys did not see this unexpected change coming in for you. Um, if this is somebody you already know, or, you know, you met, yeah, the lovers is here. It's like somebody may reach out to you or something like that. Maybe you already came across this person and maybe you guys were just friends and now you want to be more than friends here or something like that. What's the lovers here? Yeah, the fool card. Somebody's going to take a leap of faith to balance something out come in okay modest energy not too much not too little okay um somebody's definitely going to take this leap of faith they're going to be very innocent with this energy here and yeah i don't know people are going to feel defeated that's watching you maybe these are past lovers that wanted to block you yep and they're seeing that you're going to be extremely happy here or maybe you get into a new connection and then now all of a sudden your past people want to call you or try to circle back around. They're going to see that you're already happily in something new here. All right. I do feel like somebody here is definitely going to be attracted to you here with this physical connection here. There's going to be a lot of touching and a lot of hugging and loving on each other here. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Seven of Wands. You may be a little guarded at first. Okay. But I feel like with the Herifine energy here. You're definitely going to be taking it to the next level here for sure. And it's going to be a success here. I feel like you're going to be dealing with someone that's going to be very honest towards you here. Speaking some type of truth. They're going to be in some type of power or authority. Maybe you're in the leadership position. They're going to be in the leadership position. Take it how it resonates. You could be an entrepreneur. They could be an entrepreneur here. Yeah, they're going to take this leap of faith. This is a new beginning in love here that you have manifested. This may be somebody that feels like a twin or something like that here, okay? Maybe you guys had similar experiences of being left out in the cold here. And yeah, maybe some of you guys had to leave family members behind or you created families and you found out that you couldn't work out with that person, okay? Take it how it resonates, but you're able to co-parent uh, with that energy or something like that. Yeah, somebody's definitely going to be receiving this offer here. And somebody's going to get this commitment that they truly desire. And it's going to be forward movement here. Wow. I feel like somebody had to figure out their worth here to realize that they were worthy. Yeah, it could have been the masculine energy here. Yep, with the Ace of Cups. This is new love here. I feel like somebody could have been grieving their past or maybe a Queen of Pentacles energy here. Maybe somebody felt like they, not, they wasn't worthy enough for a Queen of Pentacles. But I don't know. Maybe that has changed now. They about to be rushing in here. Yeah, somebody from the past or you got a past life connection with. Wow, the Empress is here with the Ten of Pentacles. So somebody could have been dealing with someone in the past that made them feel like they wasn't worthy. Or maybe this King of Pentacles didn't feel worthy because you're the Empress Ten of Pentacles here. Yeah, or maybe this is somebody that was just confused or they had a lot of options or... I don't know. They choose you. Okay. <laughs> yeah. The hermit. Somebody went within and they figured out what they wanted. They had to go through a transformation or in something first, close out a cycle. And now, you know, they've been through the ringer, but the wheel is turning and damn queen of swords is here with the four of pentacles here. So I don't know if you're going to be holding back from this energy, take it how it resonate here. Or, you know, you're just protecting your energy at this time here. But it does seem like it was a lot of heartbreak for whoever this masculine energy is here. You may know this person. You may not know this person here. But it does seem like justice is going to be coming in. Or maybe somebody had to go through some type of karma. Uh, clear out their karma debts before they can come towards you. Yeah, they had to leave some type of conflict behind here. Possibly with somebody else that they could have been involved with that was burdening them and stressing them out here. I feel like somebody here does have real feelings for somebody here. And I feel like they're definitely going to be coming in and expressing this to you here. Yeah, somebody's like obsessed here. 
somebody finds somebody to be sexually attractive here. Um, nine of Cups, they find you to be wish fulfillment. And yeah, they're going to be given six of uh, pentacles. Equal give and take. And this is going to take flight here is what I just heard. It seemed like it was a long time for this new beginning to come in in love. But it is here, big baby. Somebody could have been meditating, praying, trying to figure out how they were going to be strategic. Um, I feel like this is going to be an unexpected change for some of you guys here. Somebody could have had to gain a new perspective as well. Whoever this King of Cups is, Emperor Energy. Yeah, they're bossing up here, okay? Two of Wands here. They're making a decision here to leave the past behind. And they're also manifesting here. I feel like somebody definitely had to go through some type of um, enlightenment or go through some type of judgment here before they can take some type of leap of faith. Maybe somebody had to be restored as well. And yeah, with the Ace of Swords, that's clarity. Somebody oh, definitely is single here, okay? I feel like with the Nine of Pentacles, somebody could have had to get their finances together. Maybe they were all in their head about it. Yeah, with the Four of Wands when it came to stability, being able to support you. I feel like with this Queen of Cups energy, somebody could have also had a painful end in there. Wow, somebody had a lot of options here. Queen of Wands. Somebody's now holding back from all of these options here, third-party situations here, so that they can come into union with you. Because I feel like somebody's stuck and stagnated or they're coming out of this stagnated energy here. Maybe somebody was confused on what they wanted here. I mean, you know, take it how it resonate here. Wow. What we got here? Yeah, we got falling in love here. The feeling of falling in love is one of the kind is one of a kind. Know that it is safe for you to be in love here. Wow. Yeah, maybe some of you guys experienced a lot of um disharmony in past relationships. There seems to be some disconnect. Use this time to address any issues to restore harmony in this relationship here. Somebody's definitely enchanted by love here. And somebody's going to be getting to know somebody here. Enjoy discovering new commodities, goals, and dreams as you get to learn more about each other here. And yeah, you're going to be exploring with this person traveling. Time to take a ride and explore new sceneries or each other's inner thoughts here. I feel like this is going to be a, be a real deep connection emotionally. It's definitely going to be a lot of sexual healing going on here. Sexual energy can be used to reconnect. Let your bodies release some tension and enjoy pleasure here. This is definitely going to be a vibe with this connection here. Maybe in the past you had connections and it was only sexual. And I don't know. Maybe somebody was used to that type of connection. Okay. But I feel like this is not going to be that though. Okay. Tell me more here. It's a vibe. Enjoy the good vibes and energy with this person because they are like no other. Yep. And because you were patient here. Yeah. Somebody had to overcome inner fears and now they're ready to love. Somebody's going to make a move here. Yeah. You're the main attraction here. Definitely got a soulmate here. The person you are inquiring about is your soulmate. So we got soulmate energy here, main attraction here. All right, so I feel like you're going to gain a lot of clarity here. And yeah, it's going to be a lot of emotional support in the situation with this new energy. And it's going to be a lot of quality time going on here. You may already have a telepathic connection with this energy or something about music could be significant. We got forgive and heal. Children could be a big part of this. This could be a blended family here. Family and friends may know about you or something like that, or they will. And yeah, this is like the best part. Somebody may have needed to slow down or there's going to be a lot of freedom in this situation here. I feel like it's going to be a lot of listening and reflecting here. This person is going to be a listen ear for you. There's not going to be any type of third parties. And this is definitely going to be a new chapter for some of you guys here. So whatever you've been manifesting regarding your love life here, this is what you're going to be receiving here. Interesting. So can we get some energy? All 
right, so yeah, this is definitely going to be a new cycle beginning here. I don't know, maybe it was some hidden enemies that could have been trying to stop and block this here, block your manifestation with these hostilities here. But I feel like you were being very patient here. Yeah, somebody also could have been being very strategic here or try to come up with a strategy. You could be this woman holding a coin here. Maybe you felt blocked or something like that. Or maybe you feel like it was just taking too long. But I feel like your value went up. So, you know, what they say, good things might take a while, okay? You just got to learn how to be patient here. And I feel like that's what you were doing here. Wow. So what is the world here? Yeah, the moon. So the king of wands here. So the five of swords. So yeah, somebody was definitely trying to be blocking your, your manifestations. And that's the truth here. There was a ex or something like that from your past here that was definitely trying to block your manifestations here. Yeah, wow. It's like this person here didn't want you to get on a new path. They were trying to be hostile with you all because they were heartbroken or they were obsessed with you in some type of way. Or you had a painful end ending with them and you became single and took a leap of faith and began to manifest. It's like you had an upgrade in your life here. You realize you deserve better and you begin to manifest better. Yeah, the high priestess, you listened to your intuition here and was being patient. You took the time out to heal, to go within, begin to love on yourself. And now you're attracting high vibrational energies into your life here. Wow. What is this strategy here? Yeah, the lovers is here. With the four pentacles. Yeah, you, you begin to hold back your energy from people from your past and tame the beast within because you gained a new perspective here. You could be definitely the woman holding this coin here. Your value went up here. Yeah, you're the queen of swords now. You're being more uh, stern on what you desire, what you want. Yeah, you want equal reciprocity. Scales to be balanced. Equal give and take. And that's what you're going to be getting. King of swords, queen of swords here, okay? With the nine of cups. There's going to be forward movement going on here. Whatever blockages that could have been in your life or going on in your love life here, they're being removed here. The garden and the gate here. Yeah, this could have been a masculine energy, a father figure that could have been trying to block you as well. Yep, but now they're burdened here. Yeah, because they can't block you. Yeah, this could have been a baby daddy here, baby mama taking how it resonate. That wanted to continue to break from you or whatever this is here so that you wouldn't move forward. Give you just enough so you would stay. But the world is here. This cycle is done. They're being blocked. You're planting new seeds. Leaving this energy out in the cold so that you can get the Ace of Pentacles here. Somebody really, really tried it here. Wow. Yeah, we got only loyal because of your success. So you were dealing with people that only wanted to be loyal with you because of your success. Yeah, you were a hater. They didn't have no love for you. And you were truly a loyal person here. Yeah, life and purpose. You're focusing on your life and your purpose here. Somebody wanted you to be stuck in their web here. Yep. But your third eye um, is wide open. You see things for what they are here. Yeah, somebody could have been focusing on material things or material wealth. Only what you had, what you can offer. Yeah, you could have been dealing with somebody that was a black widow energy here. This is somebody here that did not want you to operate in your purpose here. Wow. And yeah, somebody could have been very charming here, obsessive here with you. And I feel like because um, be careful for nothing, you begin to pray here. Yeah, something about courtship is going to be moving forward. And they wanted to give to gain off of you. So somebody was only given so that they can gain. So you could have been given more in a situation versus somebody from your past here. But I feel like you're not going to have to worry about that with this new energy. A new career or business here. The Ace of Pentacles here. Maybe you you and your new person are going to work together. You have the ability to attract abundance and prosperity. And yeah, abundance, choices, and options here. You got a lot of abundance coming in. Divine love. Wow. Love from a deity or God. Okay. You believe here. So you believe in true, genuine love here. Or unconditional love. And you could have been dealing with people in the past that only had conditional love here. Yeah. 
enjoying the fruits of your labor. So you're definitely going to be enjoying the fruits of your labor here. Okay. I feel like people was not uh, aware. All right. Maybe people thought that this was like real love didn't exist. Or if you, if you wait or be patient or something like that, you still wouldn't get what you want. But patience, let patience have its virtue here. Yep, the yin and the yang. We got receiving help. So yeah, you got help coming in. A new project you're going to be starting as well with the Ace of Wands. And yeah, this is going to be a business partner for you. Some of you guys could have went through divorces here or somebody's in prison in their head here because they didn't know that you were an earth angel or you serve people or um, the angel serve people that God saves here. So maybe you don't connect with everybody at the end of the day. Yeah, somebody feels defeated. Okay, this energy of anger here because you're moving on. Yeah, they can't no, no longer disrupt you or have you in competition or try to be in competition with your new love here. Like what? Yeah, first goals achieved here. Yep, something could have been karmic. Somebody was not anointed here. And they wanted to unalive you because they were jealous of you. Yep, but you got good advice here. And you're being creative. And yeah, forming a relationship. The Two of Cups is coming in for you guys here. Wow, this is beautiful. Take what resonate, leave the rest here. I hope something has been said to help you and encourage you here to keep manifesting here because you're manifesting the union that you want. And yeah, this is what you're needing to know here, beloved. That is right around the corner. It's on the way. Final messages. Wow, yeah. Big changes are coming in for you here. I'm hearing big changes. Wow. Yep, because you're going through a rebirth here. And yeah, you're using your wisdom now. <clears throat> yep, because you're focusing on your destiny. So whoever's coming in is a part of your destiny here. Yeah, we got the lunar here and then we got success. So this is going to be a very successful connection. Luck is on your side here, beloved. And yeah, wow. Let's see what Angel is going to be working with you guys here. Ooh, Amethyst. All right, there's a metamorphosis going on. You are in a vortex of deep transformation. Surrender to the process that's unfolding here. Wow, so we got uh, Archangel Amethyst here, beloved. This is a divine feminine here, energy, okay, amethyst. 